Here's the plan of the beetle today. I can only turn like 10, 15 degrees. So we're gonna need to remove the fender liners and I'm gonna need to probably hammer in some of the metal in the fenders and make it so that we can actually turn all the way. So that's the plan for today. We need to get these wheels to clear so we can actually turn this thing and not have to do a 12 point turn just to get out onto the road from my driveway. So let's get straight into that. I'm sure that somebody needs these fender liner bolts really bad, and I hate to do this, but... This is what we're hitting now. As you can see, we got that cut. Now we're hitting that seam, so I'm just gonna get one of these sledgehammers. We're just gonna do some work. After a lot of pounding later, we got a decent amount of clearance, um, but I am going to clearance it just a little bit more. Really? All right. Now, we can go all the way in. See that? Real nice. All right, we got this first side done completely cleared it'll steer all the way now so now we just need to move on to the other side but it's starting to snow lightly except now i'm gonna need, I'm gonna need to figure out what i'm gonna do about that All right, so there we go. We've got it to where the thing actually steers all the way now. And like I say with that intercooler, I just pulled it and bent it out of the way and it clears it. Not by very much, but it does clear it. So we're just gonna send it. But stay tuned because we've got a whole lot of other things that still need to be done with this thing because it still drives like crap. It needs an alignment and it needs some other various fixes. So stay tuned for the next video. But for now, we'll see you guys on the next one.